Do you have big hands? Well, I do too. Mine are absolutely massive. Oh, that's hot. No matter how big the problem is, the Hi-Yak 811 Plus is the instrument that can help you solve it. Howdy! This is Bill Bars, reporting from the Applications Lab. Today we're going to talk about how to demo a Hi-Yak 811 Plus successfully. We're going to call this video the Hi-Yak 811 Plus Demo ABCs. So I've created uh, 12 different individual videos that demonstrate the use and setup of various elements of the 811 Plus. Of those 12 chapters, we're going to talk about a few of them that are be important for you when you're doing an 811 Plus demo. For instance, number one, first thing you want to do when you do any kind of demo is you're going to set the thing up at home, including the compressor, all the tubing, fully functional to make sure that this instrument is good to go. You're also going to run a sample at home. We want to make sure this thing is fully functional and you're comfortable with it before you ever step foot on the customer's site. Two, you're going to explain the new features. All right, This is going to be available in chapter one of the video series and it's going to take you through the key new features of the 811 Plus. The next thing you're going to do is an instrument setup. Uh, it's covered in chapter five of the video series. And it's a simple little process that allows you to step the customer through the setup of the instrument. So the next thing you're going to do is you're going to set up the sensor and select the proper calibration for the type of testing the customer wants to perform. This is covered in Chapter 6 of the How-To Video Series. Of course, the next thing you're going to do is you're going to help the customer create a sample recipe. And you're going to step them through that process, and that's covered in Chapter 3 of the video series. So once the instrument's set up, the sensor's set up, and you've created a recipe, now you're ready to run a sample for the customer. So you're going to simply run it just like you did at home to make sure that the instrument is counting properly and, and performing properly. Uh, this is all covered in Chapter 9 of the video series. When the sample is complete, then you're going to show them our reporting methods. You can show them how we can export data out to a USB. You can show them how we can print out a PDF copy of the sample result. You can also show them a strip print of what they can expect if they have a USB printer that they purchase from us, the only USB printer that's available for this system. And you can also walk them through the web server setup if they wish to do that data manipulation over their Ethernet. Uh, and that's covered in Chapter 11. So this concludes Chapter and Verse of the Hayek 811 Plus Demo ABCs. And remember, in the immortal words of Jim Fate, Demo or Die. I'm Bill Barnes reporting. Good day.